soar to the cloud. All right, guys, we're at 99. Right, let's go. So without further ado, let me just make sure that my other laptop, this is how prepared I am, my other laptop is on trading view because I want to be seeing what you guys are, where we're all marking up whilst it's still taking place. And let me just say, um, I absolutely loved all the positive affirmations that you guys were throwing out. And I even had to get involved today in the AMA Finance Academy group. No, I am grateful for, I am happy and grateful for. Guys, that is, is powerful. Anything you put after the words I am will manifest. So continue working on that. As you know, mindset is a key skill when it comes to trading. So without further ado, let me introduce the main man himself, Ralph Dankwa. Let me find you here. Guys, can you blow up the chat box if you are ready? Planes, ones, anything you've got. Um, you're ready. I love it. Great, 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 great. Ralph, let me find you, unmute you. And I'm also going to make you host. One second. Can I just, can I just say a couple of things about Ralph before he comes on? Of course, go ahead. Because Ali just recently found this out, but this is a guy who's been trading for over five years. And when he holds training sessions, like paid training sessions, we're talking about people from all around the globe, from Sweden to, you know, all, all around Europe, Miami, New York. People pay big money just to be in this guy's workshop. He's been with I Am since the inception, like since the beginning. Like he's best friends with, with Jason Brown, you know. And in fact, I don't know if I'm, if, I, if I'm even allowed to even say this, but what Jason Brown had to do in order to get him on the platform, like you guys don't even, like the guy actually showed me the, like some of the messages. I'm like, wow, this is a sought after guy. Jason Brown has been after this guy for a long time. He's been in it from the very, very beginning. This is a multi six figure trader. You know, he doesn't need, he doesn't really need to be an educator, you know, but Jason literally had to beg this guy like, look, we've been friends for a long time. Can you please come on and just share your nuggets? With, with, the, with the whole platform. There's already, how many basic educators are there already in IAM? There's so many. But such is this guy's knowledge. That he sh from what I hear, his, the, the trades that he've called, that he's called already, they've all hit TP. Like, it's crazy. I think you told me that, April. It's absolutely phenomenal. So guys, I want you to know that we haven't just brought anyone here. We've brought the very best of the best. Someone that IAM have been seeking for such a long time. So when we say make some noise in the chat, guys, can you just blow up the chat box one last time? Because this guy's not even talking until there's enough energy coming out of that, that chat box. Like this guy is giving up his time, he's in Miami. Guys, if you was in Miami, what would you be doing right now? Because I wouldn't want to be, you know, trading a team that up. This guy gets no benefit from trading us today at all. But that's just his heart that he just wants to pour into us. So guys, make sure that you bring this guy on properly. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Sorry, April. Go ahead, carry on. I guess because I'm host, right? Oh, yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Wow! The man himself! Yes, sir! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Let's wow. go! Let's go! <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm excited. I am, um, first of all, I see my flag. So I'm, I'm amped for that as well. I, I see my flag. <laughs> Let's go. Listen, um, I want to give it back um, to the leadership. First of all, to Nana, you know, that reached out to me on Instagram. And he said, yo, I want you to, uh, he's seen my session. And if I could get on the team call, I said, Let's go. I, I look, I'm a person. Before I get started, I'm a person. Doesn't matter what rank you are i'm just here to give as much value as possible then then um i was uh introduced to april and april came with that energy as well i said like, oh let's do it i'm ready i'm excited it's funny because um she asked me yesterday 
because the dates got mixed up, right? Either Thursday or Thursday. I'm like, I don't care. <laughs> Let's run it. <laughs> Whenever, whatever date you have, I don't care. I'm there, right? And then I was able to speak to the man himself, Mr. Dez. And um, about probably two hours ago, we spoke about an hour just talking. And when I tell you that um, I learned so much from him, just us talking, you know, about business. And it's a black star. Yes, sir. <laughs> um, you know, just talking about business. I'm like, this is the type of person I want to be involved, involved with. Um, like I told him on the call, like, you know, a lot of, I know a lot of the chairmen, I know a lot of the leaders, but I connect myself with certain people because, you know, it's, it's just a connection, right? Um, you got to decipher who to connect with, you know, to help you to go up. And I'm definitely blessed to be on this call with you guys today. So without much further ado, a little bit about myself. My name is Ralph Danqua. I'm 32 years old. I live in uh, Miami, Florida. Um, I've been trading for four and a half years. Um, and I've been part of this company for five years. You know, I've seen a lot when it comes to this company. I've been through, you know, I've seen a lot of leaders, you know, come and go. I've seen a lot of people come and go. And part of the reason why I'm here, you know, on this platform. Am I good? Because I've seen a, a good, okay. Part of the reason why I'm here is because of, you know, I just love to teach. Before I started trading, I was a teacher, you know, and, and that's, <laughs> and um, that's, that's something that me and Des have in common, right? We, we both, you know, we're teachers. Um, you know, I taught them, you know, I love teaching, love kids. I taught music actually. And, um, you know, four and a half years ago, my wife was pregnant and, you know, I just, something just hit me like, no, I need to have, I need to find a way for me to make money for my children's children. Right. I need to find a way because my job wasn't it. So um, a friend of mine told me about trading. I got started. Um, and when I tell you what trading has done for me, like they said, you know, I don't like to talk about numbers, but I've made a lot of money trading. And one of the things that the skill set that I have is teaching. Right. So two weeks ago, about three weeks ago, Jason um, hit me up, say, hey, if you were to be a go live um, um, educator, what would you do? And I said, basics. Why? Because people want to come in and make the money. But wouldn't you rather, wouldn't you rather um, learn how to fish than be, be given the fish, right? What if the person that's giving you the fish, something happens to that person? How do you, how do you make money? How do you, how do you eat, right? So for me, I'd rather teach people how to make the money, right, instead of just giving the trades. I could do that. That's, that's easy to do, but that's not the skill set, right? So today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it off of me, and I'm going to go straight into um, the skill set. And I'm going to talk a little bit, and then I'm going to go into teaching you certain things, right? So one of the things that I've learned when it came to, actually, let me go to my whiteboard. One of the things that I've learned when it comes, when it comes to trading was I blew a lot of accounts, a lot of accounts. How many people here have blown a lot of accounts or have blown an account? <laughs> Put in the chat box, one, one, one. If you, <laughs> right? <laughs> like a lot of us have blown accounts, right? And I've blown over 15. 15 accounts, over 15 accounts, right? Over 15 accounts, a lot, right? So, oh, I see Philip Poku. I, I, know, I know what time it is. <laughs> I see that last name. Yes, sir. Uh, I've blown a lot of accounts, right? So what I did was I learned how to do proper risk management, right? So on my goal, I've actually teach this. Yesterday, I believe two days ago, I, I, I talked about this, right? Proper risk management. So if you're brand new, right, and this, this is the first thing I teach. See, I didn't teach this first because I wanted people to come and see that, you know, I have the sauce, right? Because if I started this as my first um, go live, people are like, oh, he's boring. <laughs> but this is what you need, right? Purpose management. So if you're copying and pasting, so what I suggest to people is that, because when I came in, I was in a rush. I wanted to make money real quick. And I was messing up, blowing accounts, you know, not taking my time to learn the skill set. So it took me about six months, right, to learn the skill set. Seven days a week, right, from 10 p.m. to like about 1 or 2 a.m. I was just, I was hungry, right? Some people want to come in and make money the first month, which is cool, but that's not realistic. You got to give yourself at least, I also, I also was told at least 18 months, right? Let me ask you this question. If, if, if it were to take you two years, to start making $10,000 a month, $15,000 a month, $20,000 a month, isn't that worth it? We go to school, right? We go to college to make, start making, oh, okay, I've got you guys are in, um, 
um, England. Yeah, I use euros. I mean pounds. So ten thousand pounds. Let me change change it pounds. Right. <laughs> first of all, first of all, um, let me say this. I love you. I, I, like I love your accent. Your accent is beautiful. I, I love it. I love it. So um, April. That's when I finish. Speak more so I could um, bask bask in the. <laughs> all right. So if if you are like, how long would it take? Like, how long are you willing to get a skill set for you to make a certain amount of money, right? So that's what I ask people, right? So proper risk management, how do you get to that? So let's say, for example, you come into this business and you're using the harmonic scanner, which I'll go over in a few, right? The harmonic scanner is what brought me to this company. If you're not making money off the scanner or if you're not using the scanner, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what, what, what to tell you. How many guys are using the scanner? Drop, uh, drop a 222 if you, if you use the scanner to make some money. So now watch this. If you use a proper risk management, it doesn't matter if you know how to trade or you're copying and pasting, right? So for example, proper risk management is basically like this. If you are, if you have a hundred dollar account, watch how much this, take, this makes sense. If you have a hundred dollar account, you should be trading at 0 0.01. So professional traders, right? Professional traders, they usually trade 1% of their account. So 1% of $100, let me use 100. I keep saying $100 because I'm used to that. I'm sorry, guys. I know, I know you guys use pounds. Um, but you guys, you know, just translate it. So $100, right? 1% of that is 0 0.01. So $100, your lot size, right? So lot size should be 0 0.01 at 1%. All right, so if you're doing a, if you're doing this, right, for every trade that you have, you're doing 0 0.01. Let's say, let's say, um, some of you guys might not understand it, some of you guys might understand it. Let's say you're doing a, a ratio, right, of 50 pips profit, right, 50 pips profit to um, 20 pips stop loss. All right, so let, I'll go to this. All right, so 50 pips stop um, profit to 20 pips stop loss. All right, so if you're doing something like this, you're risking, right, what you're doing is that you're risking $2 to make $5. Right, so every trade you're risking $2 to make $5 or five pounds. All right, two pounds to make five pounds. Right now, if you have a risk management like this, it is, it is impossible for you to blow an account. This is what I've done over the past um, four years, right? Six months into it, I was able to start creating my six figure, right? So after blowing multiple accounts, fixing accounts, I was like, no, 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 this cannot be it. This cannot be the way to be successful when it comes to trading. So I came up with a trading plan, which let me, let me share, share with you guys right here. I came up with a trading plan where if you start an account with $100, right, and I shared it on my go live as well. If you make an account um, with $100, let me share this with you guys. All right, so here. Uh, what is this, what's this thing? Right. So if you have an account of $100, right, you can project, right, so an account of $100 in 12 months, Trading lot size of one percent, right? Risking to make five dollars. I mean, five percent daily, right? You can go from five dollars per day, right? And I explain this further in in my in my go in my go live, right? Five dollars per day in twenty days, where you double your account in a month. This might look like minimal gain, but how? If you go to your bank, you put a hundred dollars or a hundred pounds in. Where are you gonna make? Double it that in a month. That's not happening in a, a um, Des, I'll send it to you. I'll send it to you, don't worry. I got you, right? So, so it goes from five days, right? I mean, 20 days, right? You double your account, just catching 50 pips per trade. 50 pips is small, right? So 50 pips per, so every month, you double your account. To where you started from $100 to $200 by the end of the month, your first month, Stuff $200, $400 a second month, right? Lot size is changing, right? So your third month, you look, you're making 800. If your fourth month, you got 1600 from $100 now, right? You're doubling it every single month. 
by catching 50 pips a day, 250 pips a week. So I have a trading plan, right? Before we go into that, watch. I have a trading plan where I catch 250 pips. Trading plan, 250 pips per week. A thousand pips. All right, so a thousand pips per month and 12,000 pips per year. Watch, all this, like, all this is gonna make sense. So uh, 250 pips per, per week, a thousand pips per month, 12,000 pips per year, right? So if you're looking at this, right? If you're catching 250 pips per week on a consistent basis, what are you doing? You're gaining a skill set, right? If you look at money, if you make, for example, if I make a thousand dollars in one trade, or let's see, let's see, um, like if I make a thousand dollars in one trade, like I think this is what's going on. All right, so like I just got in a trade not too long ago, right? Look, let, let, let me do this. All right, so I got in a trade not too long ago, All right? Not too, not too long ago. Right, and and this trade, right, is that I did a um, I think a standard, right? But I have a certain amount of money in my account, right? Where I'm doing one percent, one percent. That's just way less than one percent. But in order to, if you see that, where's the thing? Now? Uh, where's the thing go? Oh, hold on. If you see um a thousand dollars, right? I'm making almost two thousand, whatever. Sitting on this call, right? And if, if you see that and you want to make the same amount, but don't know that I have a certain amount of money in my account, what happens? You have to catch a certain amount of pips in order to make that money if you have a, a smaller account. One of the mistakes that I made was I see my mentor making $1,000 a day, right? Not knowing that he had $10,000 in, in his account. And then I try to make the same $1,000 a day, not knowing that I have to catch a certain amount of pips with my lot size in order for me to make that money. So I leave my money inside, and guess what happened? It hit stop loss. Or back then, I didn't have stop loss. I said, what's stop loss? What's that? <laughs> All right, he stop loss, not my friend. So I get in trades with no stop loss. And that's how I was blown, <laughs> I was blown accounts. Because I was trying to make what my mentors were making, not knowing that if I had a stop loss, if I grew it gradually, like, oh, that's how this game works. All right, so with a 1,000 pips, I mean, 250 pips per week, a thousand pips per month, right? I do this on a monthly basis, right? I have a trading plan. Let's say, for example, you want to build a house, right? You have no blueprint. You just tell tell the um the the, the builder, I want five bedrooms, I want um two car garage, I want um you know six bathrooms, right? That's what you tell them. I mean, everybody want. I mean, I want. That's that's a that's a blessing. But then, the builder put the garage upstairs. You told them what you want, but there's no blueprint, right? So you got what you wanted, but right, you told them exactly what you wanted, but that's not the house of your dream. That's not what you wanted, right? You got the blueprint. So if you don't have a blueprint, right, you're going to be in a mess when it comes to trading, right? This is why I love basics. So a trading account, 250 pips, 50 pips per a trade, right? You're doing the same thing in your fourth month. Watch this. Your fourth month, now you're looking at 1600 40 dollars a day. Your fifth month, you're looking at $80, $80 3200 in that month, right? You're doubling your account. Your sixth month, $160 a day, 64000 I mean, 6400 sorry, 6400 right? Your loss size is changing. So look, my loss size is still 1%. Loss size is still 1%. Let me do this. All right, here we go. So loss size is still 1%, all right? Look, as it's growing, the more it grows, the more you make. I'm still having my trade plan, my trading plan. Still the same thing. 250 pips per week, 1,000 pips per month. Same exact thing, right? It's growing. Your eighth month, looking at 25,600. 640,000 per trade. I mean, $640 per trade, right? It's growing. Your ninth month, you're looking at 1,280 per trade. I don't know about you, but if it, if it took me nine months to make 1,280 per trade, Aren't, aren't you willing to stay that long, stay that route? And this is not knowing your own, like this is not trading on your own. This is using a scanner to help you, 
using Gold Cup to help you, using um, 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 Price Trap. Well, we have over 12 different products, right? Strategies. If you use the strategies and learn slowly to, to gain the skill set, isn't that, isn't that something that you want to do? When I came in this, in this business four, four years ago, we had nothing. Nothing whatsoever. Guess what? We had to make it, make it do. But you coming in now, you have all this. So look, your 10th month, looking at 25, 60 per, 102 in a, in a month. Jesus Christ. <laughs> look, 11th month, looking at five. And, and a lot of people think that this is, this is um, you, like, this is unbelievable. Look, this is something I came up with. This is something I've done, right? I've done. I don't want to go into numbers, but it's something I've done, right? It came to a month. Right, sometime this was it this year? Sometime last year, last year, right? On one trade, this five, this five thousand one hundred, this ten thousand two hundred. My first year, when I knew this was real, my first year, two thousand and within my first year, two thousand sixteen, during Christmas, I made my first ten thousand dollar trade. Let me just tell you that 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 Christmas was a blessed one. <laughs> That's why my belief just went to another level. Last year, right, uh, around March, on one trade, I made $72,000 on one trade. When I tell you that this, is, this, this thing is real, a black boy from Ghana, <laughs> like this boy from Ghana able to make this amount of money just trading, oh my God. This, it's, it's, it's insane, it's insane. Right on one trade, I made somebody's yearly salary. I'm like, oh my God, God, I thank you. So if you're not willing to, you know, to be consistent, one of the things that Jason said, and I showed um Des this, one of the things that Jason said that I've been consistent. Right? I've been consistent at doing this. And if if you want to be successful at this, you want to be consistent. Look, and in 12 months, you could this could be in your account. Let's say. Let's say you don't have you don't have 100%, right? It's not 100%. You're 50% correct, right? In school, right, 50% was failing. That's fail. You fail. 50% is failing. Let's say you do 50% correct. You still make 204, 204,000. 50% correct. I don't know about you, but <laughs> this is it's insane in a $6.6 .6 trillion per day industry. So if you don't have a trading plan, if you don't have um, proper risk management, Right? It doesn't matter what you do. This is the basics. Right? This week, I took my time to go over that. So, so if, if you haven't seen it, please go on my go live, and I'll show you how to get there. Right? And I took an hour on each of this. But this is just a quick overview. I took an hour on trading plan. I took an hour on um, lot size and exactly why it's important for you. I mean, proper risk, proper risk management. Right? So if, you, if you're trading, your lot size is at, let's say you have a 100-pound account, 500-pound account. And you have a, a standard 1.00, and you're trading like, no, 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 no. And if you, you lose, and you're like, this thing don't work. <laughs> this thing don't work, right? No, no, no. You don't work. Because <laughs> this thing works. <laughs> you don't work. Right? You got to be patient to get this. Now, like, watch this. In order for you to blow an account with a proper risk management here, right? In order for you to blow an account, you have to lose 50 tra straight trades. You have to lose 50 straight trades. If you have a 50 pip profit, right? Take profit to 20 pip. You have to lose 50 times. How is that possible? In this, in this company that we, we're in with the scanner, which I'm going to right now, it is impossible. It's like, it's impossible for that to happen. All right, so let me go to the scanner. Um, let me share my screen. Uh, let's go here. All right, let's go to the scanner. And... And for those of you that don't know how to get to the scanner, what you're gonna do is go to I am that center. Uh, there's an April. Do you guys see my screen? Am I good? Okay, okay. So you go to I am that center, right? And what you want to do is you want to go to at the bottom, right? You see um strategies, right? So we go to the center, you go to strategies, right? So we go to strategies, you see. See, I use two things, personally. I use Gold Cup and I use the scanner. That, that's me personally. Go to the scanner. 
And please, guys, don't ask me why I use this because that's, that's a whole explanation. <laughs> um, all right. So this is how you get to the scanner. Or, or you can type in um, harmonics.im. Right? Harmonics.im so, uh, will also bring you um, to the scanner itself. Okay? So this is how the scanner works. Now, like I said before, this is what brought me to the company. All right? This is the, the, the product that actually brought me to the company. So if you're brand new, Please learn how to use the scanner. Please learn how to use the scanner. Now, how it works in a simple way is that this yellow thing, right, is called uh, an harmonic pattern. So as you can see here, you see the patterns, bat, gartley, shark, shark, grab, I mean crab, I said grab, crab, shark, shark, right? That's not important, right? It's not important whatsoever. All you need to know is you're entering wherever D is. So if D is at the top, you're looking to sell. Right? Again, if D is at the top, you're looking to sell. If D is at the bottom, you're looking to buy. Right? So for the, let me show you history of what the scanner does. And guys, by the way, if you have these brokers, definitely use the broker that you have. If your broker is not here, right, you have to choose a broker that is closest to your actual broker. What does, what does that mean? So the numbers might be different on your MediTrader 4. If you have MediTrader 4, Look at the number at current price. If you look at this, this for example, it says NZD CAD, right? If you look at NZD CAD, at current price is 85128. If it matches yours, use that particular broker, right? If your broker's not here, but if it matches yours, use that particular broker, right? Drop a 333 if that makes sense to you. Because sometimes we have different brokers and our entries are different from, you know, entries are different from your particular broker that you use. Right, for example, for me, I use Trader's Way and Hugo's Way, right? So I just go to Hugo's Way or Trader's Way, right? So this is how it works. Watch, watch the history of, of the, of the um, watch this. It told us to buy, D's at the bottom, told us to buy, and it's doing what it's doing. D's at the top, telling us to sell. What did it do? All right, it hit TP1, TP2. These at the bottom set to buy. What did it do? Tip one, tip two, tip three. Hmm. This thing don't work. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this thing don't work. Look. TP, it says these at the top, so it's a sell. TP one, tip two, tip three. All right. Eurocard. It's these at the top, so it's a sell. TP one, tip two. Right? It'll get to tip three eventually. Let's go to. And by the way, guys, this is part of your, your um, the platinum package, all right? So, like, uh, you don't have to pay any extra fee. So look, what's this? These are the top. TP one, was hit. TP two is hit. Come on. You know, I don't, I don't, I don't. Look, these are the bottom. Says to buy. You, all you do is just copy these numbers. Copy says entry. So look, what happens? You put entry. Stop loss, take profit. You choose one of the take profits, and that's it. You just set it on your phone, and you forget it. It's that simple to use. All right, they have trainings on Go Live with um, Ma um, Manny Kionis. All right, so this is a prime example of how to use. So wherever D is, looking to sell. Or uh, D is on top, you're looking to sell. You guys can see that I, I'm not making this up. These are the bottom, looking to buy. I am not making this up. Right, you can earn and learn while you're making. You know, you're learning. Right? You can earn and learn. So if you take the L out of learn, what do you have? Somebody type in the chat box. If you take the L out of learn, what do you have? Earn. Exactly. Right? So as you're learning, you're also earning. Right? You have the proper risk management. As I, I taught you, you're making money. Right? So it, it, like, it doesn't take a genius to come in here and make money. They don't at all. Once you start making money, you tell your friends. You know, because I know a lot of people say, oh, my friends want to see me make money first. Look, in your first week, learn how to copy and paste demo. Go live. <laughs> Go live. Copy, copy and paste. Copy and paste. Copy and paste. Copy and paste. So, you know, you learn the process. It takes time to learn the process. Right? So, that's the scanner. So, let's go back to, let's go back to um, the basics. All right. So, let's, let's go. All right. So, I'm going to erase this, right? And I'm going to teach you um, something, something that's very important. So, as, as you're using the scanner... Right, you want to be able to identify a trend because on the scanner, 
right? If trend is your friend, as they say, if the trend, if you're trading with the trend, right, you want to um, take TP3. If it's against the trend, you want to take TP1. Again, if you're trading with the trend, TP, um, TP, TP, TP3. Against the trend, TP1. Look, talking right now, Jason, Jason Brown just, just, just texted me. Oh, I, I got to listen to that later. It's a voice note. Um, all right, so let's do this. Um, so identify a trend, right? And this is also on my, on my go live. Um, there's an April. I don't know um, how much time I got, but um, can you guys text me? Because I can't see your face right now. I just see my whiteboard. Somebody can text me just to let me know. Um, Cause like I could go on and go on. <laughs> right, identify the trend. If you're excited to be on this call, type in the um type in the chat box. Let's go. I'm ex I'm apt. Type in the chat box. Let's go. <laughs> in the chat box. Let's go. <laughs> I'm so apt. I'm so apt. I'm so apt. I'm so apt. So excited. I'm so apt. So excited. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> I'm, I'm apt. I'm apt. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I did find a trend, right? So we have um, the first thing when you start trading, even if, you, even if when you're using a scanner, right? You want to know how to, how to do, um, you want to know how to use um, the trend, right? So, Let's say, for example, we have, you see this. All right, so let's say, for example, we have, we have this right here, All right? Is this an uptrend or a downtrend? Let's see. I know some of you guys have been, been in the class already with me, and you guys been to IM Academy. Okay, okay, th okay, okay, April, I got you. I know you guys have been through the, um, is this an uptrend or downtrend? Some of you guys already know. Let's see in the chat box. <laughs> up, up, bullish. Yes, sir. Right? Some of you guys might not know what this is. Right? So this is an uptrend. Why is it an uptrend? Why is it an uptrend? Let's see. Why is it an uptrend? Why is it bullish? Why is it an uptrend? Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. Higher highs and higher lows. Exactly. Exactly. So it's an uptrend, right? Because we have we have the highs, we have the lows. Right. So for example, right, the, the very summit, right? The peak of a mountain, right? Just think about a mountain. You see this as a mountain, right? So the peak of a mountain we have here, right? This is called your higher highs. Right? So I'm gonna do HH for higher high. So if you're able to see, if you're able to like note higher highs, right? So if you got higher highs here, right? You also want to have also higher lows. Oh, shoot. Higher lows, right? Higher low. How do you know what is a low, right? So an easy way for you to know a low is that you want to look at the previous higher high. Right, you want to look at previous higher high. And let's just, say just draw something like this. Right? So on your previous higher high, you just draw, draw this. So let's just say this is not here yet. All right. So we have a high, we have a high, we have a high. Right? So it's a staircase. So you are the person that is going. You are here. Staircase. Staircase, right? So watch this. At a previous high, if you take that previous high all the way over, then you're looking for the market to come back and retest. No retest, no entry. So if price breaks and comes back, when it's coming back, there's always retest, right? So a lot of times when I first got into this business, I seen green. Oh, green, green, green. Let's buy it. Let's get in. But what do they teach us? You buy low, you sell high. The very basic stuff that sometimes we forget. 
right? We forget the very basic thing. So look, you buy low, you sell high. So if it's going, if, if it's moving, that is not low. That's not a low. So if you see green, we're not getting into green. No, we're not buying when we see green, right? We buy when we see red. We see a lot of red. I'm like, hmm. It's getting, it's going to, it's doing some type of counter trend trading, right? Counter trend. So we have the pulse move and now the counter. Pulse, counter. Right? We always buy when we see a counter. And one of the first things I look for before I enter a trade is, is it at the previous high? Is price at previous high? Right? If price is not at previous high, I'm not even looking to enter no trade. So if price, again, if price is not coming back to where previous high was, I'm not looking to enter a trade, right? So with this example we have here, if you're looking at the scanner, also, you know what, let me just share my screen so that I can go back and forth easily. Share my screen so I can go back and forth on an easy basis. All right, so here we go. Um, I wanna make sure I can see. You guys can see my screen, right? I'm good. I just wanna make sure you guys can see my screen. Uh, let me, all right, cool. All right, so with this example here, right, if you are able to, right, so on the scanner, it says EUR CAD, right? What I would do personally is I will go to EUR CAD on my, on, on my actual trade. Um, how did I get there? All right, so let's say um, I go to, sorry, uh, USDJPY. So, the scanner is telling me Euro CAD, right? Okay, so what I'll do, like this is simple, like simple stuff. My friend, come, stop playing. All right, so, hey people, can you come off the internet so some ask can be faster? <laughs> oh man, Euro CAD. All right, so Euro CAD, right? I'll look for the trend, right? I'll look for it. Hmm. Is this an uptrend or downtrend? I think I was going over this yesterday. Yeah, I, yeah, I was going over this yesterday. That's funny. Wow. Look, look at this. So do I see an uptrend or downtrend? And what I want to do is I always want to look at the bigger time frame, right? Because if you go to one hour, right? And this says, okay, oh, this is a downtrend, right? So you're looking at, let's say 15 minutes. And this is a mistake a lot of people do. They see something like this. Oh, I'm selling, I'm selling, I'm selling, I'm selling, I'm selling. And then when they start losing or they, they lose the, um, the, the trade, they're like, but Ralph, why, why did I lose that trade? Guess what? Go to a bigger time frame and tell me if this is an uptrend or downtrend, right? Go to a bigger time frame and tell me what's going on. This is clearly an uptrend on a bigger time frame, right? This move is a counter move. So I'm looking to buy instead of sell, right? This is clearly an uptrend right? Clearly. So if I have an uptrend here, right? And this is a counter move. I'm looking for some type of rejection at some point. So guess what? Look at this. This is why I like to draw my low highs and low lows, high highs and higher lows. So watch this. I'm kind of going a little bit deep, but this is the kind of stuff, the kind of sauce that I'll be teaching. Look at previous, look at previous highs. Why did it reverse there? Because the previous high. Right here, and I and I love looking at um, looking at my line chart. Right now, I use something called quarter theory, and I'll be teaching this as well. Right, quarter theory is basically what the banks use. I I don't know if you guys know about that, but I'll, I'll teach that. So look at previous high. Right, I'm back test to you got a high, you got a high, or you got a high, you got a high, or you got a low, you got a high. And this is actually how I draw my spread and resistance, which I'll teach as well. I'm, I'm kind of jumping in, you know, just so you guys to know a little bit, right? So I'm back testing, I'm back testing. I'm looking at low, right? I'm back testing. And I haven't looked at this previously to this. I haven't looked at it. You got a high, you got a high, right? So I'm seeing that this could have been an area that I could have jumped in for a buy, right? I'm just, I'm just going through like, like my process of trading, right? So if I see this, and I, I don't know if you guys use Fibonacci retracement, but I can promise you that this is probably at 
right? So all this stuff I've been going over is step by step. It's taking my time. All right, so that's that's looking at 50, right, 50%. It rejected at 30.6, right? So 50% right here. So these are another, another way for me to enter markets, right? So, so with this, like, you know, like some of us are looking like, huh? I'm, I'm lost. This is exactly why I'm here, right? This is why I love teaching basics because I go over these things step by step by step by step. If you got a question on this, I'll go over a whole subject about how to enter a trade. So point of resistance. Supply and demand, using zones, using Fibonacci, higher highs, higher lows, trend lines, um, pip, how to catch it, um, how to calculate pips, how to do this, right? All this comes into trading. This is why it takes it takes time to learn this. Right? Four and a half years of mistakes, you know, I'm bringing all that concepts, right? So when we go, uh, are you mad? Where's, oh. Uh, all right, let's go back to whiteboard. And I'm, I'm not like, I, I'm, I'll be done in a few, right? Because I know um, I'm just, attention span is very small. I don't like to go too long on this. Right? So once you identify your high highs and high low, right? That's the first thing you got to know as a trader. There's nothing else. The first thing you got to know is identify the trend. Because if you don't know where the trend is going, you lose already. Right now on a downtrend, on a downtrend, you're looking at the opposite, right? So on a downtrend, I'm sorry guys that um, I'm not in the chats. Um, not make some money take it. Uh, yep. Oh my God. Quarter three. No quarter, quarter, not quarter, 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 like a quarter. Q Q U A R T E R quarter, quarter three. Don't worry. I'll be teaching that. All right. So don't, 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 um, Hurt yourself. All right. So on a downtrend, we're looking at opposite. Oh shoot. Um, downtrend. And I'm not telling you about a quarter three that changed that changed my win winner percentage from about ninety to ninety five percent. Like I hate to lose. Losing is not part of my vocab at all. <laughs> I, I don't lose a lot because I'm patient. I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait for so long just to get into the trade. All right, so on a downtrend, you're looking for, right, higher highs, I mean, lower highs and lower lows, sorry. Lower highs, lower highs and lower lows. All right, so lower highs here. So you have, I'm gonna do LL as lower highs, and then LH, LL, lower highs. At L lower highs. At L lower highs. Oh shoot. <laughs> I'm sorry. At L low lows. I'm sorry. My my mind is my mind is thinking of food. You understand? Low high, all right. So low highs. Low high. Low high. Okay. Um so, all right, so in this case, right, remember we're selling, oh, that's something I forgot to do on the other one. We're selling high, right? So we always want to sell at our lower highs. So what happens is that you want to identify your low lows. As you identify your lower lows, just like what I did on the lower highs, I mean higher highs, right? You just make, bam, sell, bam, sell. So in this case, I create, once price is coming up, this is where I'm looking to do what? Sell. Patience is the game. I'll wait till I see this. And then I'll look to enter the market, right? So this is a little bit um, about uh, what it is that, you know, I do, right? It's a lot more, but this is a little bit about, you know, the, the aspect. Of what, so let me show you one, one final thing before we, before I, I so let me show you this. I'm gonna show you the example. USD JPY, right? Which is my favorite, my favorite pair. Um, all right, so, so USD JPY, right? I call out a trade on Sunday, 
right? USD, JPY, sell 107, 107, 300, stop loss, 106, 750, take profit one, take profit two, 106, 500. Now, I, I've been waiting for this trade for two weeks. When I say I'm patient, I'm patient. I waited for this trade for two weeks. Why? It's because the market right here, right? So look, look, look what I have. And this is like a concept of how I trade. So I've drawn trend lines, right? So in this trade alone, right? This is um, a, a downtrend, right? You have the lower highs, lower lows, lower low, lower low, lower high, lower low, right? Lower high, lower low, right? So I created a, a trend line channel that directs me to where the market is going, right? And when I say I trade basic, I'm a naked trader, right? That doesn't mean that I trade naked. I'm a naked trader means that, <laughs> That means that um, um, I trade uh, like without using no indicators, right? I don't use indicators at all. So I trade based on something called technicals. So I've been waiting here, waiting for it to break. Once, once it broke, I'll call that that trade, wait for that retest, I put a sell limit, and bam. So what am I doing? I'm looking to catch this trade from all the way up here, so all the way down here. How many pips is that? I don't even know. Right, so I'll calculate this into my actual trading. So from here, to all the way down here. That's almost 500 pips right there. So in one trade, I could possibly do my month, right? Half of my month, one one trade. So trading is a, life, it's, it's a skill set. Last year, I went on two cruises, one with my family and one with my, with my personal family, my, my, um, my mom, my dad, my brothers. Um, my brother's wife and my nieces, about 10 of us, right? And on that cruise, on vacation, I was able to make money on vacation. Why? Because I, I got in the trade just like this and just left it. I came back, you know, I was up a certain amount of money. You know, I went on my first cruise with my wife's family, which was paid off all, every, every single person, 17 people. An eight day cruise, I paid for it, right? And I pay, also, also paid for my, my, uh, my parents, my, my family. So I paid for two cruises and I came back and I made the money that I spent on the cruise just by seeing something and just leaving it. So I made money on the cruise. It's, this business is incredible. This business, listen, I'm, I'm, oh my God. Oh my God. Look, listen, I'm just, I'm so asked for, look, let me tell you back history and then I'll, I'm done. I was in college for eight years. Not to be a doctor, <laughs> not to be a lawyer, because I, I just wasn't getting math. I was failing math over and over and over and over and over. All right? I was failing over and over. So for somebody like me to be here on this platform, to be able to teach people, if somebody like me, eight years of college, when is four? Right? Four years, eight years of college. Somebody like me to be able to do this, like you can't tell me that you can't do it, right? So um, with that being said, right, I'm going to pass it back to, um, is it April or, or Des, which one? Look, 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 both of them don't know who. <laughs> All right, let me pass it, let me pass it to Des. All right, let me, let me pass it. No, none of them know who. All right, let me pass it back. Uh, make host, there we go. All right, Des, back to you. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> April, I'm coming back to you. You're going to close it down, April, okay? So I'm coming, I'm definitely coming okay, back. Okay, okay. <laughs> I just wanted to just say a few things real quick. Firstly, wow, okay? Just like my, my belief system now has just gone through the roof. You know, I will be that, I will be in a position where I can pay for my whole family to go on a cruise and then make that money on the cruise itself. You know, mm. that's absolutely wild. So I'm loving that. So guys, if you got any kind of value at all, from that call, can you just put a guys just put whatever you want in the chat box? Just just show some appreciation, however you want to show it. Just blow up that chat box because what you've just gained. <laughs> That's kids. That's <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> <laughs> so my so my nuggets my my takeaways consistency is so key to be consistent and use 
proper risk management. Now, I remember being at live conventions, sorry, live events, and they used to talk about risk management. And I used to think, yeah, whatever, that's boring. You know, I want to do my big lots. But when, you're, when you have good risk management, you can never blow an account. You can mm. never blow an account. Guys, even if you're 50% successful, you have to lose at least 50 trades in a row to, 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 to blow an account. So that's a key takeaway right there. Patience. I think you said you waited. Was it, was it two weeks to enter into a trade? Yeah, two weeks. Two, two weeks to enter a trade. Patience is key. How many of us just jump into trades, you know, willy nilly? It kind of looks half right, so we just jump into it. Patience is the key. The harmonic scanner. If you're, if you're not making money with a harmonic scanner, guys, that's what brought him to the company. He's not the first person to tell me that. That they're already top traders, but it's because of the scanner that they join IM Academy. I think I, shi- I, I signed Shane Francis in the same way. That scanner, do you know the people that are trying to get their hands on that scanner? You know, there's people that have tried to take Christopher Terry to court because of that scanner. And we have it for free, no extra charge whatsoever. Um, guys, if you're not doing so already, I want you to, I want to implore you to, to, to follow um, Ralph on Instagram. His handle is Mr. Danqua. Um, April, if you could just pop that in the chat box, please. Mr. Danqua. Um, and also, I just want to give you his go live sessions. So, um, Saturday and Sunday, 7 p.m. UK time. So, if I've got that correct, so you, you, you're 2 p.m. Eastern. Yeah. So that's so Saturday, Sunday, 7 p.m. UK time. And then there's another session on Monday midnight. But because it's midnight, it's kind of like Monday, Tuesday, right? So it's kind of like it should be Monday, but it's midnight going into going into Tuesday. Okay. So I think that's 7 p.m. Eastern. You do that Monday session, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's so that's yeah. So Saturday, Sunday, 7 p.m. If you can put that in the um in the chat box, please. Saturday, Sunday, 7 p.m. UK time. And then there's another session, midnight, Monday, Tuesday. Yeah, you can see what I'm saying, okay? It's like Monday, but it's going into Tuesday, midnight. That's the other session right there. Um, if you're new, if this is the first time that you're even, you know, um, hearing my voice, hearing Ralph's voice, if, it's the, if you've been invited here as a guest, I want you to know that, firstly, it doesn't matter if, if, if everything didn't make sense. That's okay. You just need to know what's possible, okay? And, and if you are here as a guest, I want you to reach back to the person who invited you and ask them to get you started on a risk-free trial. We can get you started risk-free for seven days, okay? So make sure that you do that. That's very, very important. And I just want to say one last time from me before I hand over to April, um, just a big thank you. I really appreciate you. I appreciate you giving up your time. You're in Miami. So many things you could be doing right now. You know, we, we went to Miami for the convention back in 2018. Beautiful place. And um, I just want to, you know, thank you. God bless you for giving up your time. So many people got value. Your servant leader, um, you know, I posted something on Instagram. Jason Brown hit me back straight away. You know, he's super excited about the connection. I can't wait to work with you closely. Thank you, Nana. A big thank you to Nana. A big, big thank you to April as well for setting this up. This is not easy. Locking down. Guys, do you know what it takes to even be an IM educator? Like the hoops you have to jump through. There's two people on the chat right now that I'm trying to get to become educators and they know who they are. Okay, so I know the hoops that I have to go through because I'm talking to Spieler. I'm talking to Spieler every day who's in charge of the educators and she's saying that you gotta do this, you gotta do that. So I know the hoops that, that these educators have to go through. So they have to be profitable. Their strategies have to be profitable. So guys, you're learning from the very best and this is someone who was sought after as well. So thank you so much. I appreciate you, appreciate your time. Don't take your time lightly at all. I'm going to make April the host because she is the hostess with the mostess, April Lee. This is the lady that you really need to thank. So I'm just going to make, in fact, I'm just going to unmute. I don't think she she doesn't need to be the host. Okay, you should be unmuted. Yeah, there you go. Yes, I'm I'm muted. Gosh, Ralph, thank you so much. Really do appreciate it. Even when I got the time mixed up, you were so like catering and said, it's fine, like whatever works we'll do it so we really appreciate it. i can see all the love in the chat box guys i've posted the times that he's on go live if i'll post it again i'll just copy and paste take a snapshot um just so you have it let's up our trading games we've just finished the first quarter of the year we're going into the second we've got three more left there are three more quarters to change your accounts around wow. practice wow. good risk management 
Listen, I hate when I blow an account and I haven't blown an account in a long time simply due to good risk management, not over leveraging my accounts. Um, like Ralph said, if you've got a hundred pounds in your account or a hundred dollars, because I know um, we've got Marlon and Ashley in the chat as well. If you've got a hundred dollars, use 0 0.01. The breakdown that he's just given us of how he compounded his account to the amount that it was, so I didn't even write down that figure, is powerful. We do not need to go chasing the markets, allow it to come to us. The market's there, it's not going anywhere. It's been there since 19, how long? Guys, um, again, just thank you so much. I hope you got a lot of nuggets from this session. It's been recorded. Jump on Go Live, make Go Live your friend. If there was one thing I didn't do in the beginning, it was that I didn't lock into Go Live. Lock into Go Live like how you lock into Netflix, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's do mm -hmm. that. Des, thank you so much as well, just for being a great, great, great example and great leader. Oh, that thing as well, the, um, yeah. the, the, um, the notes that he was going to send us as well. That's gold dust. I need to get my hands on that. Yes, yes, <laughs> please, if you can. That would be great. That'd be great. Yes, guys, um, if someone invited you onto the call, go back to them. Join us on this journey. Find out how much it is to just get started risk free for seven days. So if you think you know we're talking rubbish, get your money back. But I guarantee you won't. Change we're changing lives here. Um, and it's powerful. Great community. Love you all. Have a great evening. You know, let's go back and get to the charts again. Absolutely. Recording will be coming out as well. Um, are you recording to your computer or the um, cloud, April? The cloud. Brilliant. So we'll get the link sent out to you guys. No problem at all. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Aaliyah. Let's go, Kinnup. Yes, Aaliyah. Let's go, Jessica Walker. Yes, Jess. Let's go. Oh, yes. Let's go, Louisa. Let's go, Tommy Little. Let's go, Ash. Wow. Let's go, Sonale. Sassy. Sherelle, Sasha. Let's go, Sherelle. Let's go, Mary. Mary Edwards. No way. That's not Auntie <laughs> Mary Edwards, is it? Is that, is that Auntie Mary? <laughs> wow, wow. Yes, Auntie. Yes, Auntie Mary. New prospects. You're signing up tonight, Auntie Mary, whether you like it or not. <laughs> Let's go. Auntie Mary's fired me up. I didn't even know she's going to be on the call. Wow. Oh my Let's gosh! Go and Nana, place. Nana is he's, he's he wants to stay in the background, but Nana, Nana you're again. amazing. I'm, 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 I'm Nana. Great friends. Let's go, Jamie Marshall. Let's go, Emery Talbot. Thanks, Ralph. Let's go! Let's go! Guys, we're doing a blitz call right now. <clears throat> If you've got any prospects, plug them in. Amefinance.com forward slash link. Blitz call right now. Let's go. Danny, come and do it. Let's go. Danny. <laughs> Let's go. Hey. <laughs> Des, you need to get them to say just like that. They're making money on DAX. Say just like that. Their mommy, their mommy's making money. <laughs> mommy made us say. Just like that. Making money on DAX. Say Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Say, let's go. He's going to say it. He's just going to look at it. One's loud and one's and one shy. <laughs> go, 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 go. That's it. All right, guys. I'm going to love and leave you guys. Have a great evening, guys. Take care. Let's go. Let's Thanks, go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Take care. Bye 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 bye.